How to Calculate Quantity of Soil or Sand for Filling Plot Soil filling is one of the essential features required for every construction project. For construction works, we need a plain surface. So far in every construction either you need a plain plot or you need soil or sand for filling the plot to make the surface plain. So in this video, we will discuss the calculation process to find out the volume of soil or sand and the number of trolleys or tucks required for filling the plot. Calculation process of soil filling or the sand filling for filling plot. Let Length of the plot, L, equals 40 meters. Width of the plot, B, equals 25 meters. Area of the plot, A, equals length times width equal 40 times 25 is equal to 1000 square meters. Let us suppose, we need to fill the plot by 0.50 meters. Depth of the plot to be filled equals 0.5 meters. Now, the volume of the plot to be filled, V equals 1000 times width equals 0.50 is equal to 500 cubic meters. This volume is for a loose state. In filling, for the compaction process of filling, we always add 30% extra for 1 cubic meter. That is, 1 plus 30 divided by 100 is equal to 1.30 for the fully compacted state. So, now for a fully compacted filling, the total required amount of soil or sand for filling plot equals 500 times 1.3 is equal to 650 cubic meters. The total volume of soil or sand required for filling the given plot is 650 cubic meters. The calculation for the required number of trolleys or trucks for filling. Suppose, the capacity of a trolley equals 3 cubic meters. So, the number of trolleys required equals 650 divided by 3 approximately equal 217 numbers of trolleys. Suppose, the capacity of a truck equals 19 cubic meters. The number of trucks required equals 650 divided by 19 is equal to 35 numbers of trucks. Note. The capacity of the trolley and truck is var from place to place and company brand. According to the requirements of the owner of the truck or trolley, they bought differently, so we did not mention standard size. If your area has a complex shape you need to divide it into easy shapes then use the above method.